Hey, what's up, SaaS Masters? My name is George, and today I'm going to show you Nimbus Node. This one is a must-get deal. Now, you're probably going to be thinking, George, why would I want to buy another note-taking app if I already have Evernote, I already have my native app on my iOS and Mac? Well, I dare say that this is 10 times better than that. Now, just to be clear, if you are just writing plain notes and just syncing, then you're good to go. You don't need this. But if you want to take your note taking to the next level, then Nimbus Note is a must get. You can do plain notes. You can do spreadsheets inside of the notes. You can embed videos. You can embed um, images. Um, you could do a whole lot. You can tag. You can create folders. You can create workspaces. You can add people to your notes. You can even share a link that creates a page with your custom domain to show those notes that actually update every time that you update it in Nimbus Note. And uh, I mean, it just you can do a whole lot with it. It's just surprising to me. And in this video, we're probably just going to be scratching the surface of what Nimbus Note does, just so you can get an idea. So enough talk about this. Let's actually see the deal and what you can expect in, this, in Nimbus Note with actual usage. So let's jump over to my desktop and check it out. All right, guys, this is the Nimbus Note deal I was talking about, and it's only $59 for a lifetime deal. Now, if you guys would like to support me and you feel that this content is helpful, please consider using my link in the description. All right, let me show you what that plan actually gets you. So like I said before, it's $59 for a lifetime deal. And one code is actually pretty good. Now, I got the three codes because I wanted to get the Brandon customer portal and the full white label that's coming soon. So what do you get with $59? You get 10 teammates that you can add. You get 50 workspaces, and I'll show you what that is in a bit. 50 gigabytes of storage. Now, why would you need storage? Well, because you're going to be adding images and maybe some files. You can actually add files, yes. And other kind of good stuff that you want to add there. And 1,500 OCR records. That means OCR is that you can take a picture of something that has text and it will convert it to text that you can actually edit. Now, if you need more, you can jump to double or the multiple codes. And if you need more teammates, more workspaces, you can jump to more codes. Now, I got three because I just wanted the branded branded customer portal and full white label. That's what I wanted. All right. But you do get C name with one code and I'll show you how that works. Now, let's go check out my Nimbus. And before I didn't mention, but Nimbus is available for Android, iOS, Mac, uh, Windows. It's on your phone. It's on this. You can use it on your, the internet and just everywhere, right? So it's available everywhere. Not like Mac. That's only available for your Mac and iOS or with Android, just with Android. Um, Evernote is available everywhere, but you know, the free is super limited and then paying monthly. Well, it gets expensive with, with time, right? So this is my Nimbus Note and I created a workspace called Video Workspace just for this video. And like I said before, it's more than just a note taking app. So let me add a, simple title right here. I'll just say title, right? And we can add simple text. So for example, just simple text. But then we have all these options available. Let's just say we want to do tasks in this if we want to use it for that reason. So I'll just say like clean room, clean kitchen, right? And you have all these available. We can create also, for example, numbered lists. So I'll just say blah, 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 and blah, 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 blah. And we can also create the spreadsheet, the table. This one is my favorite because it's super, super powerful. I can make it even bigger. So in this way, I can set the default type of table. So column type, it could be text, number, currency. So for example, I can even create a single text or multiple text if I wanted to create like um, different kind of tags in here. I can do that there. I can do some sums. I can fill up. I can do some cool stuff like this one. Let me show you um, the column cell type. For example, a rating. I'll do a rating. I'll do a over here a progress one. So for example, check this out. I can do a progress. I can do a rating right there. I can add some like, who is this? Like I can say like, this is Tom, right? And I'm going to rate him. Oops, that didn't save. This is Tom. Oh, it saved it because I created a, a type of tag one. But if it's just plain text, for example, that's Tom, right? And if I wanted to create one of the tags ones, I could use it there. It's super, super powerful and complex. I could do even some formulas, some basic formulas, not the whole thing like you would do on Google Sheets or Excel, but it does the job. You have a lot of options right here. We can do some boxes where we want to sort this. For example, if I want to drag this to over here, for example, the left side of the, nope, didn't do that on the left side of these right there. So now we have two column section. I can drag the column section this way so I can save it that way. I can add some images inside of here. 
I'll show you some more stuff. We can add an image right here if we want. We can add a file also. We have more options right here. So you got some large heading, medium heading. You can add some links. You can add some code in here, some mentions. So if you set example, if you have other users or you want to link some other notes, you can do that there. You can quote, outline, embed, um, a lot, a lot of stuff. Let me grab a YouTube link so I can embed it right here just to show you how that works. So I'm going to grab this one right here. Let's go to YouTube. And obviously, we're going to embed one of mine, SAS Master. All right, so let's just grab this recent one. I'm going to grab this link. I'm going to pause that. I'm going to go back to Nimbus, and I am going to embed it right here. So for example, I just copied and paste, and I get these options automatically. Is it just going to be an URL, a title, or is it going to be an embed? It knows it's a video. So I'm going to put that there, and it embedded that video. That's a lot of things that you could do, right? So let's go search more, outline, embed, and you can bookmark. Now, what happens if I want to share this as a link? Well, that is possible in Nimbus Node. So you got more options here on the top. You got the attachments, you got to-do list, set reminder. Also, you can set a reminder so it reminds you. That's cool. Uh, the link that I just talked about, get a public link. Now, in this case, it's saying that once you make this public, it will be public. Don't show again. That's possible. Get a public link. All right. So it just created the public link for me. I could do also embed if I want to embed in this in my site and not use it as a link. I could shorten this link if I want, if well, they provide that. And I could also protect it by password, right? So I'm going to copy this one and I'm going to open an incognito page right here just to show you how that works. So I'm going to click on that and now it's a public link. It's going to load it for me. And we have the text that we written, we have the title. We have the, the spreadsheet that we added. We have this right here. So for example, we got the video that I embedded. So you could probably be thinking of a couple of use cases with this, right? Now, right now, we are viewing the Nimbus Node logo right here, the fav icon and all that. That is customizable even in one single code from the lifetime deal. So for example, if you want to customize that, we would have to go to our Nimbus uh, settings right here. And I have my manage workspaces right here. So I'm using three workspaces and I created this one just for the purpose of this video. So I'm going to click on the three dots and I can use a branding public pages. Like I said before, this is available if you buy one code. So you don't need to buy the three codes to use the branding on this. So for example, this is a preview of it. I can use a dark theme theme right here. I'll keep it on light because I'll add a logo right now. Um, I'm going to upload a logo and I'm going to search for my logo. SAS master. Okay, I'll add that. I'll add a fav icon also. SAS master. All right. Open that. We can add a logo link also. So, for example, what is that link going to go to? So, for example, add my website. Oops. SASmaster.net. All right, I'll approve that. And you can use a full screen, the share button. Um, you can position it also. Where is that position one? Let me save this. All right, I'm sure you can position this because I want to have this logo positioned to the center like I've done it on the other ones. Uh, set logo, reset. Oh, here it is. Logo position. Okay, I'll keep it in the center. Looks a little bit more modern, I guess, instead of having it like the old style on the left. Okay. So now I have that set. Now I'm going to set a shareable link that's going to use that right there. All right, so now let's go into my workspace and show you how that looks with the custom branding. So again, let's go to our share link of this one. Click here. And now it's updated to my custom domain that I have previously added. I'm going to copy this link. Again, I'm going to go to incognito mode. I'm going to go to this page. And there we go. Now we have a custom logo, a custom link, and a custom fab icon, all branded right here without the need of buying more codes. So with one code, you get this available. So like I said before, this is something that you're not going to get on Evernote. You're not going to get on, maybe you could get on Evernote, not sure, but probably on the enterprise version that's probably super expensive, or maybe they don't even have it at all. So that's a lot of things that you could do. Now that is the power of the note taking, right? But there's so many things that you could do on your organization, set the, the settings for your users, your employees, your teammates. You can add some tags right here. So, for example, I can add a tag finance, if this were finance. Another tag that would be, for example, home, 
Another one would be, I don't know, test. And you can add those tags right here. So if this were a finance uh, note that I was taking, I could set it there. I can also add, if I double click right here, I can get a public link, remove public link, open in full screen, um, add favorites. I can also add these little colors to help me identify what this note is about. So for example, in my case, in use case, all my finance things have this little green dot. All my um, car notes have a blue dot. My deals have another dot and just so on and so forth. That helps me organize even more. There's a whole lot of things that you could do this, that you can use as a workspace, as so many things. Um, what other things can we do? Well, also Nimbus Notes comes with these two available um, Chrome extensions, which is the Nimbus Screenshot and Screen Video Recorder and the Web Clipper. I'm not going to get into that because it's just going to take too much time, but these are included in the deal. So it's super, super good. Now, what's coming in Nimbus Note? Like I said before, I, it, it's not 10 times better. It's way better than Evernote and your native Mac and iOS or Android note-taking system. They're going to be adding, this is going to be great, a webhook and Zapier integration. They're going to be adding CNAME to Google Drive, um, custom icons to folders. What else did I find? Something really interesting. Website redesign, the Android document scanner. There was something here that I also found new Android design, but they're adding all of this white label for internal emails. So all the emails will be white labeled. Also, I'm sure that one will be you will need to buy the three codes to get that enabled. Right. Uh, branding for web client and desktop. Also, that's the white label feature. The three codes. Let me show you that um, one and two codes don't have that. But everything that says white label is available upon three codes. So one hundred and seventy seven. $177 gets you that. That is what I got because I'm going, I wish I had more money to buy more, but I'm going full on till I get the white label. Just so you get an idea. Now I will leave the link to the deal. Like I said before, if you guys would like to support me and if you feel my videos are helpful, please consider using that link. I also will leave the link to this roadmap so you see what you can expect coming in the future of Nimbus Note just in case you guys want to get all that. Like I said before, it's a must get deal. You get probably a really fantastic deal with this. You can do way more than note taking, plain note taking with other ones, but Nimbus Note takes that to the next level. I hope you got to see why Nimbus Note is a great deal for you guys. And if you guys think else wise, please let me know in the comments down here. Thank you for watching. My name is George and this is SaaS Master. I'll see you guys later.